Hey team, Asad Ayub here again for the Wilson Combat Channel. We listen to your suggestions and your requests about content, and that's going to drive this particular segment. You folks have noticed that I carry a Wilson Beretta in a whole lot of the uh, videos that we've done. And the question was, why that particular pistol? Well, for a number of reasons. I've been called a gun slut because I change guns so often. Gun slut is an ugly word, so I prefer celebrant of ballistic diversity. If I'm not testing a gun for a magazine article or something, I will try to vary up enough each year so I've got something that mimics what my students have. I'm, my full-time job is instruction. 1911 for uh, probably a quarter of the year, second quarter, uh, because in June of that year, I shoot my favorite match, the Pin Shoot in Central Lake, Michigan, pinshoot.com. And the 45 1911 is probably the most suitable gun for that. In probably mid December to the end of the first quarter, is when my wife and I can fit the schedule into Glock matches that we really enjoy. So I carry a Glock pistol during that period of time. The rest of the year, it's boiled down to the third common platform, the traditional double action auto. And for me, that is boiled down to the Wilson Beretta. I've owned a number of Berettas. I've got a couple of Langdons, which the, the Wilson and the Langdon are, my God, it's like trying to choose between two different diamonds. My B Wilsons happen to be compact and my Langdons happen to be full size. So I'm more likely to take the longer sight radius gun to a match and more likely to carry the short butt one, being I'm simply not a big guy and the compact conceals better for me. Beretta is uh, no longer furnishing the base gun for the compact carry, which was done a few years ago for Wilson Combat. And it's essentially the uh, Model 92 compact. What we have here is the readily available Centurion, the uh, shorter barrel and slide on the full size frame. A whole lot of folks find this gives them ideal balance, kind of like the commander size uh, barrel slide assembly on the full size frame of a 1911. Why the Beretta instead of something else? A lot of times I'm traveling, usually in the summer um, I'm on the road. It used to be I could just buy ammo wherever I was teaching, but between the pandemic and when I teach in California, the laws there, I now have to travel with my own. Uh, you're limited to 11 pounds of ammunition on commercial air travel. And I can get twice as much 115 grain 9 as I can 230 grain 45. I figure if I'm going to be shooting 9 anyway, why not shoot a lot of 9? So in the states that allow it, I want that uh, full-size magazine. Here we have a 17-rounder. Uh, and you can also get the 18-rounder from Metgar. And the compact, normal standard size with the Beretta was 13 rounds, but here in the Mechar version, it's 15. These are excellent handling weapons. The, um, the old thing about, ooh, the double action, first shot is too hard, and it's a crunch and tick. For heaven's sake, if you have spent some time learning how to run a double action trigger, you learn, your, your hand learns, it has a single action Beretta, it has its double action Beretta, and it can very quickly learn to transition between the two. Simply get the trigger time in. You'll find several other Wilson Combat videos where Ken Hackathorn, Bill Wilson, and myself discuss why all of us really appreciate the Beretta 92 design. But basically, for my purposes here, with a Wilson gun, you've got these outstanding G10 grips that fit me way better than what comes standard on the gun. And critically important, the Wilson action tune with the Wilson parts. We've simply got a smoother, even, straighter back pull. The Wilson sights, the battle sight with the big U back here and the great big ball up front comes very, very quickly to the eye and is a natural for defensive shooting, but still gives you a, a post and notch sight picture if you choose it for a precision shot. These guns carry better than you would think for their size. This holster is from the Master Holster Company and it's one of my regulars. I found it extremely comfortable to wear. Uh, I like to get it so it fits the, uh, the flashlight uh, mounted dust cover as well as the standard tapered dust cover. And basically, with the forward tilt, the gun conceals well, and when you need it, you get a fistful of firearm that's pretty serious. 
The Beretta over the years has proven itself to be an extraordinarily reliable gun. I have 10 round magazines for it when I have to carry in the 10 round states and you can probably tell from my facial expression and tone of voice how I feel about that. But we do not break the laws. Overall, it's got pretty much target pistol accuracy, service pistol reliability, and a very affordable price. Uh, the double action mechanism is not only easy enough to learn, but pretty handy once you have it. If you have to pick one of these up in an emergency and don't have a holster and you just have to shove it in your waistband, I always leave the thumb on the hammer to hold the hammer down. It's one more safety net, so if something caught that trigger and interdicted it, the thumb prevents the hammer from rising and then falling. Other advantages to the design include the ambidextrous mag release. If you look at my hand, the old guy's uh, got a pretty crippling degree of degenerative arthritis in the hand. And it became a little bit awkward for me to do this hard little turn over here with the thumb. So by simply reversing the here, I have a quick, easy mag drop without having to break my hold on the pistol. And it all works pretty well. It's a proven gun, proven design, enhanced by masters here at Wilson Combat. And that is probably the single pistol that I carried the most in the past 12 months. The question was asked, why did I carry that one? Well, I hope I've answered. Good luck. Stay safe. We'll look for you down, uh, down the road at the Wilson Combat Channel and keep on sending your suggestions. Remember, your suggestions, your requests drive our content. Thanks.